Hi guys, I'm just going to show you now how you can submit the data that you have collected from your trail cleans. So you're going to head to the Trash Free Trails website, which is trashfreetrails.org. Now once you're there and you click on the drop down menu and select clean trails, there'll be an option down there for you to report your trail clean. So you're going to scroll down and you're going to be met with three different options. Okay, so this is really depending on how much time you have. So you've got the full trail clean report, you've got a quick report option, and then you've got the trash count. So the trash count is there for people who haven't actually managed to get out and pick up any single use pollution, which is which is totally fine if you don't have the time. But if you could spare an extra two minutes just to have a bit of a count of what you've seen, and then if you could let us know following that link there. You've also got the quick report option, which has got slightly less questions for you. I personally like to fill out the trail clean report, so let's do the full one with you. Now, once it's open, you're going to have a load of questions to answer. Now, they're all super simple. For example, the date of the trail clean activity and where you were cleaning. So yesterday we were at Winlatter. We mainly focused on the mountain bike trails there, but we also did the car park and some of the walking trails like on the fire road. And so you fill out all of these questions. Like I said, it doesn't take long. How many people took part? Approximate amount of time, that sort of thing. You can then tell us exactly what sort of things you were removing and how much of it you were removing. So you can see here, I've already filled out the section as well. It really doesn't take too long, guys. You know, here we are. Now, once you've filled all that out, you can then tell us the total number of items that you removed, what percentage of these items were single use, for us it was 100%, and whether or not you recycled those items. Then you'll be asked whether which brands you found most of. So for example, yesterday, everything we found was pretty much gel ends. So High Five and Science and Sport were our main culprits. Once you've filled out that section, you'll then be asked about animal impact. So, did any of the stuff you find show signs of animal interaction? For example, teeth marks or, heaven forbid, dead animal inside. It does happen. So yesterday we found a can that had been chewed through. Fill that in. I like this bit especially. Did you discover more than you expected? Sadly, yes. It made me feel very sad, but it always does. But once I'd removed it, I felt absolutely brilliant, so I'm going to let the guys know that. Did I feel more of a sense of connection to the trails? I most certainly did. Okay, now once you've filled that out, you can answer the last few questions. Would I be willing to take part again? Most certainly. And then you can upload any photos, any additional thoughts, but if you don't want to do that, you can just go ahead and submit. There we go. Sorted. You're now a citizen scientist, and thank you very much for your contribution, guys.